Hello mabibi na mabana karibuni ili simuletu la kuminambili sasa Lelo pita la offers ni somo la kumi na moja Na somo la leo pia ni la muhimu sana ambalo naenda kwa fundisha Ni somo ambalo lipo katika maisha yetu wa kila siku Kwa watu ambao wana unge kiingereza Hata watu ambao wana unge lugha yote Ili somo linaitua shocks and disbeliefs Shocks and disbeliefs Kushtuka na kuto kwa mini Kushtuka nini kushtua kitu ambacho mekiona kimekutisha labda Au jambo fani baya ambalo meliona Na disbeliefs ni pia kutu kwa mini Machu wako kutu kwa mini Kwa jambo fani ambalo meliona Au kwa jambo fani ambalo lipo mbele yako Au kitu fani ambacho kimetukia Sasa <coughs> Kuna maelo tunatumia Unapota kuelezea shocks and disbeliefs Na uh, watu wengi uwa kidogo wanakosea Wanakosea nini? Mtu anakuwa ajua tumie I'm shocked. Same gun. Kwa mfano, nakuta mtu labda jakuona mdambrefa na sama I'm shocked to see you. Wezu kumuambia mtu I'm shocked to see you. Labda awe mzimu. <laughs> labda awe mzimu utamuambia I'm shocked to see you. Lakini mtu kama ujamuona mdambrefa muambia I'm shocked to see you. Kuna temu sazaki. Kwa tuwanze somu. Wangale jinsi na jukua. Kuna temu ya kwaza inaitua I'm shocked. Au kama nafsi yote nizu kuweka po. I'm shocked. We are shocked, they are shocked, my mom is shocked, my dad is shocked, etc. Unavu tumia shocked, tumia kwa jambo ambalo si nzuri tu. Mwanao likuwa anakili darasani, anashika namba moja. Hamekuja mekuletea majibu ya form 40, pala utakuwa shocked. Kwa hivyo, I'm shocked to hear the news. Nini unakilezea? I'm shocked to hear the news about Mr. President, late Mr. Magufuli's death. I'm shocked to hear the death of President Magufuli, the Tanzanian President Magufuli. Follow me. I'm shocked to hear the news about the death of President of Tanzania, Mr. Magufuli, ni meshtuka kusikia habari kusu kifo cha raisi wa Tanzania wana Magufuli. I'm shocked to hear the news about Kanumbo's death. Ni meshtuka kusikia tarifa za msiba kusu Kanumbo. I'm shocked to hear the news about the capsizing of MV Bukova. Nimeshtuka kusikia habari za kuzama kwa maili ya MV Bukova. Kwa unaweka vitu vibaya. I was shocked today to see the, to see the accident at Kariko between Dala Dala and Motorbike. Nimeshtuka Kusikia kuona uh, ajali katia dala dala na piki piki. Kwa, I'm shocked ABCD. I'm shocked dash dash. Unaweka kitu ambacho tu siki zuri. I'm shocked to see the grade of, grade of my son declining. I'm shocked to see the grade of my son declining. Na nimeshtuka kuona max za wanangu zinashuka Kwa sabu kutegemea hilo swali Temu nyingine ambao unaweza kuitumia ni shock yoyo lakini kwa uzuri Kuna kushtuka kwa uzuri Na hii unatumia neno I'm stunned Or they are stunned Or we are stunned Kuwa stunned ni kushtuka Lakini kwa jambo zuri Mtu mepoza na nani mda mbrefu wa mjia unano kimoto mwapu I'm stunned to see you Nimeshtuka kukona lakini siyo kwa jambo baya Umeshtuka kumona kwa sababu ulimis mda mbrefu wa mjia yuko nani Lengine kwa mfano I'm stunned by her clothes She looks stunning She looks elegant Follow me I'm stunned by her clothes. 
She looks fantastic. She looks stunning. She looks fabulous. She looks elegant. Manaki una umeshanga kumona mtu kapendeza kweli kweli huyo mdada. Sio ilikuwa ni bibi harusi, sio alikuwa ni nani, lakini kiukweli umemwona alafu umependa vile ambavyo amependeza kupita maelezo. I'm stunned by her performance. She was fabulous. Nimeshangazwa, nimeshtuka na alivyokuwa anafanya performance inaweza kuwa kucheza inaweza kuwa anaimba mashairi inaweza kuwa kuimba chochote kile au inaweza kuwa mtiari kaufanya vizuri unaweza kuita performance kwa hiyo unashangazwa ni jambo zuri ambalo ukilitegemea litatokea na ndio maana stunning pia ni sifa mtu akipendeza sana unamwambia you look stunning umependeza umelipuka umependeza sana Are we together? Okay, that was stunning. Kuna nyingine inaitwa taken aback. Ukisema I'm taken aback, hapo mbele unaweza kukaa chochote, lakini taken aback maana yake ni kama kuduazwa, kuachwa mdomo wazi kwa mshangao. Kwa hiyo taken aback inaweza kaa jambo zuri au jambo baya. <coughs> jambo zuri au jambo pafano. I'm taken aback by, by his behavior. I'm taken aback by his behavior. Ni fata. I'm taken aback by his behavior. Nimeshangazwa, nimeduaza na tabia zake. Anafanya nini? Maybe ana strip nguo, ana anavua nguo mbele za watu kale wa sana kwa mfano, anavua nguo, ana katika mavuno mtu ambaye ana heshima zake. You can be taken aback by that. Kwa sababu unashangaa huyu mtu ambaye anafanya vitu kwa sababu sikuvitegemea. Au I'm taken aback He has traveled to US. I'm taken aback. Follow me. He has traveled to US. Nimeshangazwa, nimeachwa, nimeduazwa. Amesafiri kwenda Marekani. Kwa hiyo unasimulia kitu kizuri, lakini umekuwa taken aback, umekutegemea kama kile kitu kitafanyika. Kwa taken aback inaweza kuwa jambo baya au taken aback inaweza kuwa jambo zuri wala hakuna shida. Kuna it is unbelievable. Siamini. Uamini ni inawezekana kitu kizuri au kitu kibaya. Kitu kizuri au kitu kibaya. Are we together? Okay, hiyo ilikuwa shocks. Kwa hiyo kuna vitu kushtuka vitu vizuri kushtuka vitu vibaya kuna shock yenyewe ambayo usimwambie mtu i'm shocked to see you kwa sababu shock ni kwa vitu vibaya peke yake lakini stand unaweza kuitumia kwa kitu kizuri umekishangaa taken aback unaweza kutumia kitu kizuri umekishangaa isipokuwa shocked be careful usitumie shock kwa vitu ambavyo vizuri usimwambie i'm shocked to board a car unamwambia mtu umeiti umeshtuka kununua kwani ulizani hawezi kununua gari kwa hiyo inakuwa mtu anaweza kukamaza kumtia mawazo kwa kutafakari wewe imekuwa ni Mwambie I'm stunned your body car hapa sasa. I'm taken aback you have a new car hapa sasa. Okay, tuje this beliefs. This beliefs ni kutokuamini. Sio kutokuamini kama Mungu yupo, hapana. Kutokuamini kitu ambacho umekiona mbele yako. Kuamini jinsi kilivyo. Sio kuna maneno ambayo tunatumia kuna I can't believe, unaweka hilo swala ambalo uamini. Follow me. I can't believe kuna neno la pili i can't imagine sipati picha unaweka hilo kitu ambacho kimekufanya wewe usi imagine umeona kuna nyingine it is incredible inashangaza now i can't believe inaweza kuwa kitu kizuri au kitu kibaya i can't believe he won the race siamini ameshinda mbio follow me i can't believe I can't believe he won the race. And again, I can't believe he has died with corona. Siamini amekufa kwa corona. Follow me. I can't believe she has died with corona. Oh, by corona. 
na hapo kweka preparation nzuri sana ni buy pamoja wa zao wa jana weka with buy kwa hakuna tatizo kwa sababu speaking ya wazawa kama unaona six while sometimes unaweza kuongea katika broken lakini wenyewe mnaelewana hamna tatizo lot you know can't believe i can't imagine kuna it is incredible inashangaza as i can't imagine for fun i can't imagine they are able to get along with each other in fact i can't imagine they were able to get along with each other each other means now get along ni msemo maana yake kuelewana get along kuelewana kwa sio sipati picha wameweza kuelewana wao kwa labda walikuwa na ugonjwa wa muda mrefu you never know kwa hiyo upati picha vile ambavyo wameweza kuelewana nyingine it is incredible inashangaza hii huamini kwa kitu kizuri it is incredible they got married inashangaza wameoana unashangaa umeshtuka lakini uamini lakini kwa jambo zuri it is incredible my son is number one in the class it is incredible my son is the number one in the class in the class in the class inashangaza mwanangu amekuwa namba moja darasani kwa hiyo ukitumia i can't believe inawezekana jambo zuri au baya weka chochote I can imagine spat picture weka chochote it is incredible kitu kizuri peke yake weka chochote na sometimes ndio katuma it is unbelievable I am inishi umekuwa speechless kuna kauli kitu kichotokea pale mbele kuamini inaweza kuwa jambo baya au ikawa jambo zuri asante sana topic hii ni ya muhimu itumie kila mahali unaposhangaa au kushtuka kitu na nimekuelekeza vitu gani vya kukitumia time si nimekupa kwa nategemea utakuwa mtu ambaye unashangaa sawa sawa kwa jinsi inavyotokea kulingana na tukio ambalo limetokea mbele yako asante kwa kunisikiliza na wapenda sana usisahau kunifuata katika channel yangu official teacher subscribe like my teachings naomba uende kwa uka, uka, uka share hizi clips peleka kwa yule kundi mbalimbali wa support waone kwa hiyo unifuate subscribe bila alama kengele Uleteo tarifa kila niki post somo nenda sio teacher underscore allen njoo katika facebook teacher allen twitter teacher allen tiktok teacher allen na ukitaka kunifuata katika whatsapp njoo katika namba hii 0712425583 na Mungu awabariki sana somo linalofuata nalo ni mzuri sana sana niliwaambia sasa hivi tunaingia katika masomo ndani ndani kidogo kuhusu Kiingereza kwa usikose kipindi asante sana Nakuwa hivi